YouTube. Welcome to Icy Island. It's your boy East Air. Say we got an oil change on the 2015 Impala LTZ. And I'm going to double up and show you guys actually how to change oil at the same time. you want to get all your supplies ready you want to jack the car up get the jack stand underneath chalk the wheels if you need to and get your uh, oil drain pan underneath so first we'll be taking off the oil filter it's located on the top make sure your drain pan is you know underneath where the actual oil will be spilling So once you've gotten the oil filter actually loose, you can actually loosen it up with your hand. Make sure you watch where the oil actually spills so it doesn't burn off later. And if it does touch anywhere, make sure you just wipe it down. You'll be screwing it back into that hole. Before that, put oil on the O-ring just so it's sealed properly going back in. got the new filter in and tight it's time to go down low and remove the drain plug make sure you get the pan underneath because I spilled oil so many times and oil is hard to clean up All right, so now that oil is drained out, we want to get the drain plug back in. Make sure you hand tighten it first and then go over with a wrench or ratchet. Make sure it's tightened fully though. we got to do is put the oil back in. This car acts for six quarts, so I'll put it in a five quart and a single quart. All right, so once you've got the new oil in, it's time to close up the system. Start the car up, turn it off, and then check your fluid levels. The first time you pull out the dipstick will be to check the color. The second time will be to actually check the actual level of it. So once you've got all that together, Last thing to do is dispose of the oil and reset the light inside of your car. Alright y'all, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys learned how to do an oil change. If you liked the video, please like, comment, and subscribe if you didn't. Leave your thoughts down below. Let me know how I can do better. Catch you guys next time.